Hi everyone, welcome to my channel, where I talk about tips and tricks in accessibility and technology. Today I will talk about how to set up automatic recording in your Teams invite, where the meeting recording is saved, and how to manage it. Now let's go. To set this up in Auto Calendar is pretty straightforward. I can click on Teams meeting in my meeting invite and the uh, meeting options. You will actually see the option to record automatically. You just need to click on the checkbox, save, and uh, send your meeting invite. To do this on your Teams uh, calendar, you can click on one of the meeting you already set up or set up the meeting first. You will see the meeting options in Teams. Um, you can turn on the record automatically here and save that. Now let's look at the attendee experience. So now I'm Megan attending a meeting that Richard just set up with auto recording. Click join. You will see that even an attendee joining this meeting will actually trigger the recording very shortly. There you go. You can see recording has started and this is where the auto how the auto recording get triggered during a meeting. So where the recording is being stored now, Megan can go to her OneDrive under the recording folder. She will see the meeting recording just happened from the auto recording. Under share, you will notice meeting organizer as well as all the attendees within your organization have the permission to the recording. Sometimes you want to control only meeting organizer can trigger the recording. Uh, one simple way to do this is go to your meeting option settings. As a meeting organizer, select only me can bypass the lobby. This way both the meeting and the recording can only start by the meeting organizer and save to the meeting organizer OneDrive. Thank you for watching and I hope you enjoyed the video. Always remember to subscribe and click like.